what is Kindle self-publishing keyword research? And more importantly, what is it not? That's coming up in today's video. Hey everybody, I'm coming out of Mecca and Kulieli. Which need best keywords in India and they need that problem solved, Americans. Why not? Range Rover's born supercharged. If your income goal is half a million dollars. Everybody, I'm Michael from the Blueprint Publishing Academy, and if there are three things you want to learn more about, how to one increase your income so you can take back your freedom, so you can design your ultimate lifestyle, hit subscribe, turn bell notifications on, and make sure you leave me a comment and let me know how you're doing today. Today's video, I'm really excited. It's continuation of this little five-part series on keyword research. So what is keyword research? And more importantly, what is keyword research not? Keyword research is really just finding what are the most searched terms for a given topic on, well, the platform we're talking about for self-publishing is mostly Amazon. So keywords are basically search terms. It's what the customer or potential reader is going to type into the Amazon search bar when they're looking for information or a product to buy, and that's that. So a lot of newbies, myself included, were so confused when it came to keyword research in the beginning. Once I made the switch and started thinking about what search terms are people going to be looking for, it really, really, really helped me break down how simple keyword research is. Your goal is to find what's the word or words that are most typed into the Amazon search bar for your particular niche. That will help you find the most profitable keyword in your niche. Keyword research is by far one of, if not the most important part of self-publishing. If you mess up your keyword research, you can do everything else right. But if you're not publishing a book around a profitable keyword, then no matter what you do to your book, your book is not gonna make any sales. So you really wanna focus on making sure you find not the perfect keyword, but a profitable keyword to start publishing your books around. Now this is really important for you authors out there as well. Whether or not you're writing the book yourself or you're, you're using ghostwriters, it doesn't matter. You also have to make sure that you are, you are optimizing your book for profitable keywords, profitable search terms that your readers are going to be actively looking for already. You can't just pick something out of thin air because you like it. You want to make sure your market is going to search for it first. What makes a keyword profitable? Well, I like to use the rule of six. The rule of six is when you type in a search term into Amazon, what you're going to do is you're going to open up the first six books and the first six books for those keywords scroll all the way down to about three quarters of the page to the product info and read what's the bestseller rank. You want, you want that number under 100,000. The lower, the better it is. The lower the number, the more people are buying it. And that is essentially a profitable keyword. Now, there's a couple different factors that play into how to get a lower BSR. Number one is sales. Number two is sales. Number three is sales. Number four is sales. But the number five reason on what brings down the BSR, it's, you guessed it, sales. That's the only thing that's gonna be affecting a book's BSR. So the more sales that that book is getting, the lower the BSR is gonna be, which in terms means that keyword or that search term is a profitable keyword. So how do you get really good at, becoming, at keyword research? You know what, when I was brand new, it really took me about six months to fully understand how keyword research was really working and, and, and you know what worked and what didn't work. But I've really boiled it down to three things on how to get good with keyword research. And they, it's these three things right here. Number one is practice. Doing it over and over and over and over and over again. The only way to get good at anything in life is by practicing. And I know that's not sexy. It's not a little, you know, hack or whatever you want to call it. It's the truth and it works. Number two 
it's publishing books. And I guess that's kind of like practice. The only way to get good at keyword research is by finding a keyword, publishing a book on it, watching what happens, and then learning from that, publishing another book, watching what happens, learning from that, and repeating this process over and over and over again. And you might be like, well, Emeka, I don't have all that money to spend, or I can't invest all that, or well, really that should be the only objection. It's business. Self-publishing is not like a guaranteed thing anymore, or ever was. It's business, and like in business, there is risk. But in order to get good at it, you just have to publish books and publish books and publish books. And some of those books will fail, but some of them are gonna take off. And it might be your fourth, fifth, sixth, or seventh book that boom, takes off and becomes profitable for all of those other books that didn't turn a profit for you. And the third thing is failing and failing a lot. So if you publish your first book and it doesn't do too well, don't beat yourself up. Publish another one, publish another, and publish another. The more times you fail, the closer you are getting to success. And I know that it sounds a little woo-woo and a little far-fetched out there. Sorry, it works and it's the truth. It's called Failing Forward. John Maxwell has a great book on that, actually. I could recommend you to read that, Failing Forward. But by failing and analyzing what didn't work by asking for help in support groups or your coach or whoever it is or commenting on the channel, um, that's how you learn. And by learning from your mistakes, by learning from your failures, you're able to get better. So those are some simple tips to make keyword research a little bit simpler for you here in 2019. If you have any keyword related questions or questions in general, hit me up in the comments. I'd love to connect with you, get to know you a little bit better. I also got a ton of free resources inside the description of this video. So make sure you check that out as well. And make sure you check out my playlist for 2019 publishing tips. We'll have a link in either the cards or in the description as well for all of those free resources. Till next time everybody, I'm Mecca, we'll speak to you all soon.